You want to know the highest quality export settings for YouTube videos? All right, let's talk about it. So you clicked on this video because you want to know how to export the highest quality possible for YouTube. And I'm going to tell you just that in a second. But if you want to know what platform I use to upload high quality videos for my clients to watch, stick around until the end. If you only want to know the exact settings, pause the video right now and make a screenshot. But if you're not 100% sure on how to apply those settings, just continue watching. So let's start with HD. I shoot and export all of my videos and client work in 4K. But that doesn't mean that you have to do that as well. I mean, in the end, most people consume content on their phones anyways. But I just want to make sure that my videos are somewhat future-proof. At least until it becomes normal to shoot and watch everything in 12K. Once I've fired up Premiere Pro, I click on New Project, name it HD Export, select the location where I want Premiere Pro to save the project file to and hit OK. Now press Command or Control plus N, go to Settings and check if it says 1920 by 1080. And depending on where you live in the world, if the frames per second either say 24 or 25. For me, it's 25 since I'm from Germany. All right, this is my timeline. I've imported an HD clip and just dragged it into the timeline. Once I've done that, I go to the beginning of the clip and hit I on my keyboard. Then go to the end of the clip and hit O. That way, I'm letting Premiere Pro know what portion of the video I want to export. Now hit Command or Control plus M to open up the export settings. So, format should be H.264 and preset match source high bitrate. Now click on output name and let Premiere Pro know where you want the video to be exported or saved to. On to the video settings. It should say 1920 by 1080 and the frame rate either 24 or 25 frames per second. Field order should be progressive and aspect square pixels 1.0. Now check render at maximum depth, scroll down to the encoding settings and switch to hardware encoding if it's available. If not, don't worry, this will only affect the export speed. Profile should be set to high. If it isn't, uncheck the box and change it. Level should be set to 4.2. And now on to the most important factor, the bitrate settings. Choose CBR if it's not already selected. CBR means constant bitrate and will result in the highest quality. And now drag the target bitrate slider to 50. As you can see down here, this will result in a pretty big file size, depending on the length of your video. But trust me, it also results in the highest quality. Instead of dialing in those settings every time, hit this icon right here and save those settings as a preset. Now on to 4K. There are only a few changes to make here. Let's start with the resolution. It should say 3840 by 2160. Scroll down to encoding settings. Profile should say high and level 5.2. And finally, bitrate encoding. Choose CBR and set the target bitrate to 100. This will obviously result in a massive file size but if you really want to export in the highest quality possible, I'd recommend those exact settings. Those are my exact export settings for personal and client work. But the platform I use to upload client work isn't YouTube, it's Vimeo. The difference between YouTube and Vimeo is that Vimeo won't compress your video file and therefore will playback videos in the exact quality you've uploaded it. But that's it for today's video. Until next time. Peace.